I'm going to show you guys something that you probably don't see that you think everybody's like, hey man, reaction channels are easy mode. Um, they're really not. Nothing's really easy mode on YouTube. And how do you grow on YouTube that's such a saturated platform? You got to do reactions, right? So I'm going to show you guys something on my analytics. So you see my top video, your top videos in this period which are in the last 28 days. So my top video right now is Happy and jack -a boy react to Baby Metal Rondo of Nightmare at Budokan. Five minutes and 18 seconds people watch for the duration. There are 10,116 views. I'm not, now mind you, this isn't a, a complaining thing. I'm just noticing some stuff. I go to content and then I go to this. All of this is you can't make any money on on reaction videos which is not why i'm doing this but that's a plus which is why i keep doing it but you also get this which you get a partially blocked video with 841 views and that's where it stops and it's pretty annoying um i did upload a gaming video but i set it to private uh because that's not good for the channel analytics but it seems as though it doesn't matter because I put up a reaction video of stabbing in the dark two days ago and it got 67 views right here and it's got a copyright claim everything everything on YouTube could get copyright claim no matter what it is someone could just come in and do a copyright claim then it, I, I even reacted to Godzilla versus Kong um, the official trailer all right, and it got 45 views, and it still got copyright claimed, and I'm ineligible for any type of monetization. There's there's other things like if I scroll up, I just I I put nine times a streamer forgot to end their stream, and if we look at the analytics for this, I uploaded this about an hour ago, and it's got 10 views and 0.4 watch time hours so this says about the same as usual and usually the views are updated live i'm expecting this to get about 60 to 100 views by the end of the week but my point being is that if i don't do a baby metal video i can't get 2000 to 10000 views and my channel won't grow so it, it this all depends on what people enjoy watching and if you're catering to one person or one one type of person and your seo score is not very good then well it doesn't really matter if your seo score is good it, it, it's a click-through rate thing so for this one i got 204.6 watch time and mind you i love baby metal i love reacting to their music and sometimes i just want to listen to them on my own and I can't because if I have it on shuffle play, I, if I have like Spotify on shuffle play, it won't allow me to, to react to things in a genuine way. And I, I don't want to be fake on this channel. So my reach for this one, as you can see, there was exponential growth here. So it starts off slow and then there's exponential growth and then it just flat lines a little bit up here. So a lot of this is my watch time hours for this one video. This one video keeps me partnered on YouTube so that I could actually earn a little bit of money if I need to. And mind you, again, I'm not complaining, but look at this. Reaction channels are the way to go, man. Especially if you're doing like baby metal. I'm not sure how this video on December 8th, 2020 got 1,714 views. It was a Cyberpunk 2077 launch trailer reaction. And I was excited for the game until I wasn't. <laughs> Which is kind of funny. And it's funny because there's no restrictions on it. I would have figured this would have definitely had a copyright claim. But it doesn't. It even had like a copyrighted song in it and it got no copyright claim. So this is weird. Happy reacts to Black Tongue. Uh, uh, Black Lungs. No, Black Lungs by Architect. How is this not copyright claimed? 
Look at it. No copyright claim on it. I'm so confused. And yet, anything that has a copyright claim gets like 10,000 views. 2,000 to 10,000. My cat is loving stuff right now. Um, but this is my reaction channel, and I'm not sure if I'm going to upload this video to my reaction channel. It might be, actually, because it has happy reacts up on the the top over here, right there. And, yeah, so it seems like you, you guys actually liked my, you know, my vlog. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that again. And you know what's really weird to me? If I go on to my live stuff, my like my live stream video, this got a copyright claim on it and it's partially blocked. This is weird. I'm not sure why. It's it's just weird. Like and then the thing is look at this. I'm so grateful for you guys for getting me up to 1500 subscribers. But if I post like original content, like 1500 subscribers should get me like 100 views on a video at least. I'm so like this is this is very confusing honestly like I've been trying my best to like ride a wave of like bring me the horizon and baby metal like I love them I love the two bands but I want to veer off and do some other stuff too this this stuff you don't think it's hard but it is and I don't I don't think doing reactions is the way to go for YouTube just do your own original content live stream I'm gonna continue with this because I, I actually enjoy doing this. The editing process is fun. But for anybody else, if you're looking to grow on a platform and you really want to grow, you need to make super specific content. This has not updated since it hit 10 views. This is, it's weird how this is popular, but guys, I just wanted to inform you on stuff. This is just a quick video, not a complaint not a complaining video if you guys enjoyed this i don't know what to say you could like it or dislike it i don't really care this is just for to show you my analytics and stuff and how much i make on youtube literally nothing if you want to see in the last 28 days i made 32 dollars and um let me see for the last the lifetime of this video so i made 38 dollars and 65 cents on this channel so far so yeah i just wanted to show you guys that that's what you make with a reaction channel partnered on youtube with a thousand five hundred subscribers so yeah i'll catch you all later peace out guys